Hi, Scott. Hi. How are you? Oh, nice to see you. I'm good. Can um, you see me now? I don't know why I can't see you. I, I can't. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know why. Um, um, it might be the two mobile devices, um, you know, the iPad and the phone and things. Scott, would you be willing to continue the conversation, although you can't see her, or would you like to do um, an autograph and things of sorts? Well, how would you like to proceed? I'm happy. Can you see me? Can you guys see I me? I can or... totally see you. You're wearing yeah. a red <laughs> or a pink shirt. I can't quite decide. Fuchsia, maybe. It's, it's red. <laughs> Is it red? It's red. And a black yeah. leather chair. Yes. You have a, you have a goatee. Um, <laughs> yes. I you. I can see you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, let's do this. Awesome. <laughs> I'm going to restart the timer and you guys will be all set. Thank you so much. Hi, Scott. Where are you? Do you have an accent? What is your accent? Yeah, around here they don't say that. <laughs> I'm from Melbourne, Australia. Oh, you're from um, Australia. Okay. Yeah. Our, um, you know, like how we've got like the harshest lockdown right now on the planet because, um, do you? Yeah. yeah, so we can't leave our homes. Um, and we're, you know, kind of feeling it out as to like when we'll be allowed to, you know, to get back to not, not just normal, but just like even just leave our homes. Um, because we've got that curfew, you know, um, by 8 p.m. at the moment. Oh my god! I didn't realize that you. I heard that your cases were going up, but I didn't realize that you guys ended up having. Uh, did it just start, or has it been going on for a while? It's been um, well. We first had six weeks, then um, a premier came and extended it by two, mm -hmm. and said that you know based on on data, which we hope you know you just you follow <laughs> the rules, and um, you know we just got to stay positive and stuff. Yeah. Um, I've been a big fan of your work for ages. Like, you know, I've been watching, you know, the 100, um, obviously back at Eureka and, um, just, you know, Supernatural and all, all those things. It's been really cool. Is, is there any shows that you, that you haven't been in? No, <laughs> I mean, there's lots of shows that I haven't been in. Um, yeah. yeah, I mean, I feel I have done a lot of, a lot of variety for sure. But um, no, there's a lot of shows. I've, as far as science fiction and um, that kind of stuff, I've done a lot of it, yes. Yeah. My mm -hmm. brother was just here. He's asking if you would ever do Doctor Who or something. And I'm like, um, there's got to be one thing you're not in. <laughs> isn't there two? I've never done Doctor Who, you're right. Um, there is a UK one as well, though, isn't there? There's an American and a UK? Or is there just an American oh, Doctor Who? I thought it's just UK. Oh, um, no, I think they did an American version of Doctor Who. Did Maybe they? Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I've Either way, I've not been on that show. I have no idea. And would I do it? Yes, why not? Of course. Yeah, yeah. you've just been on everything else. <laughs> <laughs> I have worked a lot. Yes, I've been very lucky. Yeah. I cannot complain. Yeah, you've done well. How have you been through this whole thing that we're calling 2020? Do you know what? I am, um, I mean, on a more personal level, I lost my father uh, three and a half months ago. And so COVID um, is not really, I'm sort of indifferent. <laughs> COVID is not really affecting me. Um, I've had greater in my personal life, you know, um, but uh, I'm, a, I'm also a stay at home mom most of the time. So to be home with my family is not unusual for me to be home all the time. Um, when I would leave my house, I didn't love that because, you know, the masks and the, you know, just being ultra, ultra nervous about who you're around and who's coughing and who's, you know, so that's the stuff I, I, I'm not a huge fan of. Um, what are you guys doing for groceries and stuff? Like, do you, are you allowed to leave for that, to do that? We've got this rule where one person per day per house is allowed to leave and go for grocery shopping. Um, is there a time, we're allowed is there a time limit? Like how long I think can it's go? Or... Limit. Not so much in the groceries, but there is um, for exercise, we're allowed to leave the house for one hour a day just, you know, for a walk and still have to wear masks and things. Wow. Um, but it's, sad. it's um, yeah, because like we, we don't want to fall into the group of um, it, the wrong group that basically kind of like, you know, um, do the wrong thing. Yeah. And 
and it, to some extent, like we're all really, really, really hanging out for some freedom. And, and it's really hard to post anything online without being put into one of two camps, <laughs> if that sort of makes yeah. sense. Yeah, um, no, I get it. People, yeah, and and um, I guess like online, like posting online, the comment section online, like it's it's very emotional, mm-hmm. <laughs> and people have you, you never know, like you know what a person's personal circumstance is. So it's really tricky to kind of like you know to you put something out. How is that going to affect a person? Yeah. Um, and sometimes we just kind of like you know hang in there, stay quiet, and. And cross our fingers, going like we're going to get some freedom soon. You know, we're doing the right thing, and we're going to. How many cases get do you guys freedom. have? Do you know? How, sorry, what? How many cases do you guys have? Is it that bad?